Hey, what's happening muchachos? Welcome to the video. So first of all, I'm starting off my day with some peanuts. This is how I start every single day. If you guys don't know why I do this, go watch my previous video to get some insights. And I'm also gonna get in a workout, man, because you know, I need to get a pump. And today's workout, we're gonna be doing chest. And we're gonna do it at home, man, because you know the saying, no chest, no sex. And honestly, I don't want my muchachos to be incels during the new year, all right? I wanna make sure you guys are set. But I gotta be honest, man, even though the plan is to make this a home workout, you guys know me, man. You know that I don't like working out indoors. So it only makes sense to take this party outside. So for this workout, what we're gonna need is a pair of pyrolets. Now, some of these exercises you can do without them, but this will help you take your gains to the very next level. So muchachos, if you don't have pyrolets, I'm gonna link them in the description box below. Go pick them up on Amazon, or you can just do some of the exercises on the floor. So the very first thing we're gonna do today, guys, is something called a pseudo planche push. -up. Let's get it. Muchachos, man, that exercise was no freaking joke. So I'm also sure some of you guys right now are probably wondering, dude, what happened, man? Why are you wearing a jacket? Why do you change your shirt? And what happened to your hat? Well, that's because it's the very next day. When I tried to record the talking parts in the video yesterday, it was way too windy, man. You guys couldn't hear me. So instead, I'm going to record it again and tell you guys what I did throughout the entire workout today. First thing we did was something called a pseudo planche push-up on the parallettes. Now guys, this is not any regular kind of push-up. This would take your push-ups to a whole nother level in terms of difficulty. And we're doing this for four sets of six reps. Now what makes this movement a lot harder than a regular push-up is the fact that you have a forward lean throughout the entire movement. Your shoulders are in front of your wrists and your wrists are close to your hips when you're pushing. This is gonna change your center of gravity and put more emphasis on your shoulders, your chest, your triceps, and strangely enough, also on your lats. This is a great upper body developer, man. To make this as difficult as possible, you want to maintain that forward lean. You might be tempted to kind of rock backwards, but the further forward you lean, the harder it is going to be. And for my muchachos that don't have access to parallettes, you can also do these on the floor. Now, doing these on the floor is actually a little bit easier because you don't have as much range of motion. So if you do have parallettes, I do highly recommend you use these because this is gonna make it harder and it's gonna give you more gains. Next up in the routine, we got a movement that's gonna improve your one arm pushing strength. This is a one arm assisted push up. And we're gonna use the parallels to assist us. So if you look very closely, you see one arm is extended straight, very similar to an archer push up on the rings, while the other arm is pushing. So if you're currently working towards a one arm push up, this is a great exercise to put into your routine. And today we're doing this for three sets of eight with each arm now some things you need to watch out for is you want to make sure that the arm that is assisting is straight the entire time the more bent your arm is the easier the movement is going to be the straighter it is the harder it is and since you're trying to get gains you want to make sure you do it correctly another thing you want to watch out for is your elbow placement so a common mistake that i see a lot of muchachos make when they're doing their push-ups is they have their elbows flared out almost parallel to their shoulder. This is a no bueno. This is gonna hurt your shoulder in the long run. You want to think of it as an arrow. Keep your elbow pinned 
close to your side as you push. This is going to activate your chest a little bit more and it's also going to reduce the chance of injury. And the healthier you are, the more gains you can make. Also, for muchachos don't have parallettes, to do this move, all you need is an elevator surface. You could get a pile of books, put your hand on it and do the push-ups, or you could do what I'm doing right here and use a cinder block. Gotta get creative. So as you can see, even if you don't have access to parallettes, you can always get creative and use the things in your environment to still make some gains. Next up is one of my favorite push-up variations, and this is called a Hindu push-up. And we're gonna do this for three sets of 10. Now, why this is one of my favorites is because this really helps you emphasize that upper chest. It also hits your shoulders, and it's gonna make your triceps burn like freaking crazy, but it is also going to improve your mobility. So to do this push-up, you start in a pike position. Then you press your chest down onto the floor, and then imagine you're going under a barbed wire, and you're gonna bring your head up into a cobra pose. You hold that pose for about a second and then you return the movement in reverse. Guys, this right here is going to burn your shoulders, your upper chest, your triceps, as well as your core and also improve some of your hip mobility. Excellent, excellent exercise. Don't be surprised if 10 reps is pretty challenging. So this workout is pretty short. We only have four movements, and for the last one, we're gonna be doing some tiger bend push-ups, and I'm going to do this for three sets of maximum, as many reps as possible in each set. So these push-ups right here, they look like a party trick, man. They're gonna put some hot sauce into your training, and they're actually a lot easier than they look. So this is how we do it, right? First of all, you start into a regular push-up position, like so. Come down, chest to the floor, don't just to the floor, bring your elbows to the floor, bring them up, back, just like that. So you see, boom, 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 they can go faster. Oh, 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 oh. And this is another excellent variation of explosive push-up. It's pretty much gonna be working the same muscles that you do in a regular push-up, but will give you a little bit more emphasis on your triceps because of the transition phase. Excellent, excellent move. And by the time you're done with this, guys, your chest, your shoulders, your triceps are gonna be burning, begging for mercy. So even though I did this workout outside, you guys can do it indoors and you can get some massive gains. All right, muchachos, that is it. That is the workout, very short, simple. Give this routine a go, believe me, you ain't gonna regret it. And if you like this video, you guys know what to do. Go ahead and give this one a mm, thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what you doing, man? Go ahead and subscribe. And muchachos, muchachas, always remember this, guys. Always strive to improve, even if you're just a little, each and every single day. Kaizen, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.